Hello, Hello Europe. Europe! I'm Nikki today. And I'm Dear. And we're doing our last nail video of this season. It's yes. going to be the video for the top for the big five. And we're gonna do our own personal top three and maybe even do a and, little And prediction. Israel, Israel as well. Oh yeah, don't forget yeah. Israel. They no. won with their great song Netta from Netta, the toy yeah. song. The yeah, the song. chicken yeah. song. No, it's not a chicken song. It was about women empowerment. Of course, yes, yes. And they make funny noises. With yeah, a that's... chicken sound in it. But anyways, it won fair and square. And that's why we're going to Tel Aviv this year. But first we're going to listen to the uh, French entry of for Eurovision. Tell, and tell us what we think about it. Which, exactly. which is very interesting, of course, yeah. Mm. It might be, I don't know. This way, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, know, you could just stop watching. <laughs> yeah, you... Okay. Oh, there it is. Okay. What's this? Oh, this is Bilal. Oh. He's a young guy, lots of, lots of Instagram followers in France. And he's gender neutral. But, en français, je l'aime beaucoup. But the great thing about this, what I think very nice is that Bilal is originally he's got Moroccan origin yeah I know he's so Moroccan. that he does this I one of my exes is a Moroccan and it's very difficult for those people to you know be who they are and that he does this for such a big audience chapeau very chapeau for that for la France I've seen this live, and it wasn't as good as I thought it would be. I hoped it would be better, but I think we've seen enough about this now, haven't we? What do you think? What do you think? I think Eastern Europe isn't ready for this. <laughs> I don't know. Honest, yeah. I, I think he might get a lot of sympathy votes from from uh, yeah. from the the gay community from Eastern Europe, but that's not that's not going to be enough. No, I don't think so either. The song is sweet. It's nice. Is it the best song at Eurovision? No. Um, so, no. Do I like its message? I love its message. Of course, do, it is. I do. Yeah. Am I very proud of this kid doing this in such a for such a big audience? Incredibly proud because mm. he is giving off a very big statement. Yep. But is it good enough? <clears throat> I don't think so. So the next country is Germany. Germany is hit or miss the last couple of years. Yeah, last year they had a beautiful, great oh, song. I loved last year's yeah. entry. I sh that should have actually scored higher for me. For me, that was my personal favorite. So the German accent. I want to like it because last year's song was so good. But it's very difficult to like this. Of course, they're singing with a falsetto voice, and everyone's oh, come on. Is this a good song? No, sorry, Germany. That's Love the yeah. women empowerment message, but I think North Macedonia has got a way better nor yeah. women power empowerment message this true, year. True, true. So skip to the next one. Yeah, I'm gonna skip this one. Sorry, I'm Germany. Sorry. Tut mir leid. Es tut mir sehr leid. Ich liebe euch da in Deutschland, aber das Lied hier war scheiße. Das geht gar nicht. Nein. Das ist scheiße. Das geht leider gar nicht. Now we're going to continue with the host, Israel. Shalom. Shalom, Israel. Yeah. We're, we're waiting for... They, had, uh, they have had some very, very great, great uh, entries. Exactly, the they're years. great. I love the Oprah op 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 Haza. And I love the, the 2010 entry... Harald Scott with Milim. I love that song. It was brilliant. I love Diva from Dana International. Yeah, of course you uh, do, yeah. I love that song. That's I Mallorca. love it. That's it was your comedy, you know? Yes, yeah. I know. That's but I, I also loved, I know everyone thinks it's a really stupid song, but I love that song. It's like, Hallelujah. Yes, it's, very, it's very cheesy. It's but very cheesy, it, but it, I love to sing it. Yeah, of course, yeah. And but... we're expecting a very, very great big show from you, Israel, yes, because you can yeah. do it. So you I'm expecting it, yeah. a lot from you. you so... Let's see you what haven't let us down in previous years. So. Exactly. It's Israel. Okay. Okay. Yeah. He reminds me of the look, anyway, of trying to be a f the the Israeli in Freddie Mercury. Oh yeah. This is a very old school ballad. 
Sorry. <laughs> oh, please. I like that last bit that he's coming home. But the oh, chorus. Uh, oh, God. Of course. This is like the great pretender, Freddie Mercury. Yeah, exactly. Putting all these replicas on himself. Yeah. It's very pretentious. It's. They're trying to sing a very beautiful, pretentious ballad. I'm sorry. And especially the thing they're saying, I am someone, I am someone. It's so. Oh, for dramatic. I'm sorry. I do like the video. <laughs> the visuals are great. Yeah. He's got a great voice. I know that he pulls this off live. And he's not. He's not. And he's, he's not hideous. <laughs> no, he's, he's definitely not hideous. No. And he and he he sings oh, this wait, wait, very wait, wait, well. Wait, wait, wait. Interlude. What? No. Oh. It's so cliche. This. Is it the worst song this year? No. Is it the best song? Definitely not. No. I just, I just, I think, I think it's so cringe-worthy to say that uh, I am someone. Oh, I am yes. someone. Yeah. Okay, now I've, oh. I've heard too much. You heard too much. No, I don't like this song. So, what do you think of Israel? No. You did, great singer. Tried your best. Yeah. Not but the not song of the someone year. Someone I would vote for. Sorry. No, it's definitely not someone, someone, no. someone. It's not going to be someone, no. No. Not at He's, all. No, so so you, don't, you don't have to be afraid, you have to organise it again next no, year. No, that's, no. that's for sure. So no. that could, could be quite a relief <laughs> on your side, yes. It costs a lot of money, yeah? Yes, of course I mean, it does, you're yeah. flying a Madonna for the... For the oh, yeah, yeah. So that costs a lot of money. So don't worry, you don't have to spend that much of, um, that that amount of money next, next year. Next year, you won't, you know, you won't have to suffer You know what, well, we'll do it for you, yeah. no. No problem, yes. we'll do it. Well, no I'm happy problem. to do so, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So let's continue with another contender. Italia. This is Italia. Soldi. Soldi. Mamma stai tranquilla, sto arrivando. Te la prenderei per un bugiardo. Ti sembra l'amore Am I crazy or do I hear a lot of auto-tune again? So do I. It's got a contemporary vibe. People are probably going to love the little clap. It's hard to say something sensible about this song because it's it's, lo it's, it's so auto-tuned that it's hard to tell if it will, it will stand on stage like this. The thing is, in uh, the Italians always compete with the San Remo uh, yeah, festival, no. and apparently no, 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 this this song got a lot of jury votes, but a, a not so many from the uh, tele vote. You know, he skimmed through because of the jury. The jury really wanted this song. But the, well, the it's audience, more, it's the more like a, like, didn't. No, no. It's quite repetitive. Yeah. A lot of people like Italy. I don't know why, to be honest, because I think it's quite repetitive. I know it sounds contemporary. And um, I know... He's good looking, but it's it's just not doing it for me. This song. No, that's, that's what I said. I, I think it's too many, too much auto tune, and I think it's it's gonna. Yeah, I don't think it's, it's going to be. It's going to be a disappointment on stage live. And otherwise, it wouldn't. Honest, it wouldn't do that on 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 the record if he wouldn't need it. So. The staging, Italian staging, has been very terrible the last couple of years. Sometimes they had a really good track and they fucked it up with staging. Okay. And. Mm. They might fuck it up again with staging, and I, I don't think it's such a good track, but still, it gets a lot of points, and some polls it's number one, and it's a fan favorite <laughs> for the Europeans, Eurovision fans, apparently. Do I like it? Not enough, but will it make top three? It might, because, you know... That's what I think. It could make top, th yeah, top three, top five, yeah. I don't know. Maybe the staging to, is going to be their, their incredible. Their advantage is they're the one of the big five, so of course they're in, in the finals anyway. So that is their advantage. I think that's this is. The, I think this is not going to be an advantage for them because I think when I heard this song for the first time, I really needed to get into it. Yeah. And 
Imagine everyone listening to this song in Europe for the first time and 60% needs to get into it. There goes a lot of votes. Yeah, that's true. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. The next one, Spain. 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 Okay. España. What is this? Very Spanish. Auto tune. Apparently, he's not a very good singer, but he's got so much charisma. Yeah, he has. He is very cute, though. Yeah. That he pulls it off live like. Everyone, when he starts to sing this bit, everyone starts to party. I understand why, but I think it's very cheap. I think it's very unoriginal. But will it win? No. Will it get high in the. Maybe. If he pulls it. I think. This is a, a song that's a great party song that works when you're at a concert and had a couple of beers. But will it work on the on the t on the television for Eurovision? Will that atmosphere come through? I don't know. I, I'm, I'm very curious if it would how he, uh, how he would be performing live because yeah. But the thing is, like I told you, at the Eurovision concert in Amsterdam and also in London and in Spain. He pulls it off because um, everyone is a little bit drunk, everyone is singing along, everyone is bombing along, everyone's singing so loudly that they don't yeah, course, hear yeah, that yeah, he's yeah, out yeah. of tune. Well, and it. it's a big party. And that's of great. what the video is all about as well. So It's a big, yeah. big, big party. But will that come through on a television stage? I really, yeah, that's, it all depends on staging because you don't have live on instruments, instruments either. So. I, I think the only way he's going to pull this off is by getting into the audience. Yeah, he has to. I yes. think he. I think he's. He is going to. Yeah. Yeah. I think. Okay. This is a tip for you, Spain. If you if you're not done with your staging yet, do something in the middle of the audience. Yeah. Maybe get a little stage in the middle of the audience. Let the audience be part of your performance. Exactly. That, that makes I think it, that does the trick. I yeah. think that yeah. will do the trick. Then everyone will yeah. see. Oh my God! Everyone is partying. This song would be a party. Yeah. Then you're going to get lots of points. That is true. So this is a tip from the Dutchies. We don't want you to win, no. but we want you to do well because he's a cute guy. You love and to be on holiday in your country. So. Exactly. <laughs> too. We love to party in Spain. Oh, yes. Next one. Yeah, I think I've heard enough. Exactly. I've heard quite enough. Now. So, uh, is it a contender for the number one spot? No. I don't think so. Okay, next the one, other big five. The next, the last one we're going okay. to watch. Here's the song from Brexitania. <laughs> sorry, I have to make. I had to make a joke. Sorry. Mm -hmm. So yes. We're from from the Netherlands. We're your friends. Still, we are. Yeah, we. Yes, Michael bigger than us. Yeah. <laughs> that is quite com. It's quite funny, isn't it? <laughs> Michael Yeah, we are bigger than you. That is so true. Yeah. It's your uncle. Did you see that? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the Dutch television show. It's a big, big show at the moment. Did you know that this song is co written by, this, by uh, the Swedish uh, entry? I, I'm not surprised. I've heard them on the Grover Norton Oh, they got a gay dad couple. Of course, yeah. They're appealing to the gay community. He's on and of box. course, oh, the kid is not allowed to play with the gay, dad, gay kids. The gay couple kit. This is actually the divide in the, in, in the United Kingdom. Yeah. This is actually the, cell, the whole story. You've got the ignorant people voting for leave, and you've got the Remainers who are open and friendly. Yeah, of oh, course, well, I'm not allowed uh, to be please, no, you're not supposed to say these things okay. in a flow. No, no, no. Mm. We should bring the people together. Exactly. If he pulls this off live, You've got a good yeah, voice. Yeah, that's got that, that's got, uh, that me worried. You think he cannot pull it up live? I don't know. I've heard he does. I, did, okay. I think we're not we're not buying these kind of messages anymore from the UK nowadays. Yeah. Sorry, mm. there is that is where Brexit true, is coming true, in. True, true, true. Sorry. But is it a? Is it gonna win? It's not no. that bad. As we seen it performs it live. Oh, uh, look, 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 look. And now everything will be fine because the kid was saved by yeah. the gay parents. And now they're gonna come together. Yeah. See it now? They're gonna come together and be best friends. Yeah. Fabulous! Oh yeah! Oh, oh wow! Yeah. Oh. If only you could do that for real. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Please don't mention the Brexit. So, is it gonna that go was, somewhere? That was the last one, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Is is this gonna go somewhere? The 
I don't think I'm gonna. I, I don't think they're gonna get many points. No, no. It's not because it's the not song because is the song that song bad. bad. No, but I think it's because of the atmosphere at the moment towards so, the United they're, they're, Kingdom. They're just not granted nowadays. So. Yeah. Well, you did it yourselves. Okay, you should, you, our five favorite ones. Oh, we have to do our top three, our personal top three. Yeah. Jesus Christ, that's difficult. It is. Do yeah. you have your personal top three? Uh, okay, my personal top three, and, and it's very hard. Yeah. But I know. <laughs> well, since I was about John, it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I, I knew you were gonna go there. Um, my personal so, top yeah. three. It's very difficult because there are there are a couple of very good songs this year, but um, I think I think that the number one. Of, I, I, I'm sorry to be so chauvinistic, but it has to be Duncan. Yeah, it's gonna be for me. It's gonna so be it's the gonna Netherlands be, as well, yeah, but that, not because I'm Dutch. <sighs> mainly, no. no I think it's a very actually, good song. But actually, I believe in this song this year for the first in many years. Exactly. So I think yeah. The second one would for me would be, is Azerbaijan. Would be Azerbaijan, yeah, of course, yeah. Number for you two? two, yeah, for me too. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah. not just because but you got a hard on for him. He's got a hunk. He's a hunk. No, of course not. No, this has nothing to do with it. But the no. number three is going to be difficult because yeah. I got a couple of songs. I love the North Macedonian song for yeah. half. I love the Albanian song because I didn't understand a word of it. I uh, also loved. Um, 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 I thought the Czech Republic had a good mix. Yeah, mix that's my number three. Yeah. That's yeah, my number three. Mix, Definitely. Mix, yeah. Lake Malawi. That's it's For me, yeah. it's three. Lake Malawi with a friend of a friend. Then it's Azerbaijan with truth. And of course, number one is the Netherlands. What is your no, top I th three? I think I have the same top, top three there. Yeah. Really? So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think, uh, well, it's hard to, it's, it's hard to have another one. choice. But realistically, who do you think is going to win? I really, really hope and wish that all. the Netherlands will win this yeah. year because we're so it's just around the corner for, as well. To I everyone. mean, yeah. it's been forty-four years. We weren't even born yet. So, oh, yeah. I know. My it would be very goodness. nice but if we could 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 experience uh, that once in our, our lifetime. lifetime. So yeah. please, Europe, give us these votes for <laughs> yes. this one time. Yeah. Then we'll never nag on you again. No. We'll give twelve points to everyone after that. <laughs> <laughs> what I think might have a shot at winning is um, well, of course, the Netherlands does does yeah, still have a shot at winning, fair, fair, yeah. a fair shot at winning. Um, I also think that Russia, unfortunately, has a yeah, shot at winning. Like a party, but... um, I think that um, looking at the songs we've heard that. Um, Switzerland, though I don't really like it that much, has a shot at winning. And I also think that Iceland has a shot at winning. <laughs> and I also think that, um, um, that what was that song that we just saw? Um, oh, I hope Azerbaijan has a shot at winning, but I don't think, I don't know. I think these, maybe Cyprus or Greece, no, I don't know. This, this, this is what they, I they think. don't. They don't what even do ring a bell think? anymore. So, no, what do you no. Think? I already have said enough about it. That's it's it's time to it's time to to to, 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 to end it all. Yeah, to finish. To end it all. To, to okay. finish. To finish it off. Okay. Yeah. So our top three. Because I'm hungry. <laughs> our, you're always hungry. Yeah. Our top three is, and the third place is Czech, Czech Republic. Republic. The second place is Azerbaijan. And the first place is, of course, the, the Netherlands. The Netherlands. Netherlands. Do the point. Yeah, yeah, so, thank you so much for watching. We'll hope to we'll see you at our Eurovision show in Amsterdam. We're doing a little theater show about the Eurovision Song Contest. Come and see us and come and follow us. We're going to post lots more videos in the future. Um, and we'll hope to see you somewhere soon. Um, I also wish every country competing this year lots of luck and lots of success with thumbs uh, up. Yeah, and of course this was all in jest. This was all. In, this is our personal personal yeah. views. Please and don't be you, offended by any of our personal views. Because no, we're because not to we insult don't, anyone. No, we're not. Of course in, not. Insulting we anyone. Do Definitely we don't. Not. We don't. We don't do this. <laughs> <laughs> so, but anyways, thank you for watching. And this is us signing up for Eurovision 2019. Goodbye. Bye.